And a big day at McConnell Air Force Base. There is a new man in charge of the 22nd Air Refueling Wing, Jason Lamb, there to see it happen, the change of command. Jason? That's right, Jeff. Hello, everybody. After serving two very successful years at McConnell, Colonel Nate Vogel stepping down today to take on a role at the Pentagon, and he relinquished command of the Air Force Base to Colonel Corey Damon. The ceremony in a McConnell hangar began with the presentation of the colors and the national anthem. Major General Corey Martin presented a Legion of Merit medal to outgoing Colonel Vogel. To the men and women of the 22nd Air Fueling Wing, with only a few minutes remaining in my time here at McConnell, I can't help but feel an incredible sense of pride looking back at everything you accomplished over the last two years. Vogel leaves after two years of leading the world's largest and most diverse tanker wings and conducting worldwide operations in the KC-46 Pegasus and the KC-135 Stratotanker. Under his watch, the KC-46 was declared worldwide deployable and long endurance flights became routine. What makes me most proud is that no one asked us to do this. You, the amazing airman here at McConnell, saw the need and pressed forward with bold initiatives and graduate level risk understanding and acceptance that allowed us to realize our end states with a clear eyed vision. With that, it was time for the change of command. Sir, I assume command. My vision is to assist you in your collective journey to prepare to counter any threat as a cohesive team, develop grit, and simply execute air power with a winning scheme of maneuver in any theater. We shall lead. We are AR, and we will win. Let's go. Thank you. The ceremony was attended by Representative Ron Estes, business leaders, and the mayors of six cities, including Andover and Hayesville. I've known uh, Colonel Vogel for a while now since he's been here, and it's uh, just been a great relationship between uh, the city of Hayesville and uh, McConnell Air Force Base. And uh, just being able to see the change of command uh, between the commanders, it's, uh, it's a great experience. Colonel Vogel and I have become very good friends over the last year and a half, and year or so, I guess. and and. Uh, while I, I'm going to miss him, I look forward to carrying on uh, the friendship with uh, Colonel uh, Damon as well. Colonel Damon comes to McConnell from McDill Air Force Base in Florida, where he served as a vice commander of an air refueling wing. He's originally from Iowa, and he graduated from Iowa State, so he says he's very happy to be closer to home, closer to family right here in the Midwest. Jeff?